all right guys for kage here and welcome back to the brand new video here we are again on tower of god new world so the update and the maintenance uh, is over and the update is live so let's see what everything is happening on this video we're gonna definitely do the full review of xia xia and we all and we're gonna make a, like a little conclusion how good they are Plus, we're gonna see what everything is happening now after the maintenance. Okay, leave a like, subscribe, your opinions in the comment section below. And let we start. After that, we're gonna do some summons. I will see how I will do it. Uh, I'm honestly really excited and hyped. I already see people posting in the comment section below. Yo, Rokage, I pulled him, I pulled him, I pulled him. Perfect, okay. So let me see now what everything we have. We have vacation celebration check-in event. So log in every day for 14 days so you can get like a really decent amount of free summons and other materials. So definitely make sure to log in every day. Um, let's see, Xia Xia growth mission. Okay, of course, when you obtain Xia Xia um, and you get all of these conditions afterwards, you're gonna get additional Xiaxia and uh, the same goal. Oh, we all doesn't have that, so only SSR characters have the mission growth. Okay. Uh, dangerous vacation event mission. So there is multiple things to clear here. And when you're done, you're, we're gonna get a pretty decent amount of rewards from the fragments and many other things right here. So this is definitely the thing that everyone should do 100%. Okay. Uh, that's that and then we have this let's see what is this all about this is like an event where, where we're gonna be able to exchange stuff for other stuff so we're gonna see now okay here it is let's see omg story created by net marble He's quite different from Uric Matsino. In fact, I agree. It's not, do you really think I know that only? Or I don't know why. Okay, let's skip this for now. You can check it out for yourself so we don't lose much time here on this. But definitely the cutscenes and everything else, it looks uh, pretty darn epic. So, summer vacation has begun. Check out the teammates' exciting summer stories in the event story. Clear story acts to unlock uh, acts uh, to unlock free stages. Free stages require stamina, clearing grants, event currencies, and points. Event currencies can be exchanged for various items in the exchange shop. This is that event point vacation that we can get from free stages in vacation of event. Event points are required to unlock the next story act. Uh, reaching a set of number of event points unlocks the next event story act and clearing the story act unlocks the next free stage so pretty much everything is connected so you need to get that event points and then event story act and clearing that story act will unlock these free stages the rewards you can earn are greater uh, the higher the free stage tier okay you can obtain event costumes by using a vacation tickets at the lucky draw and clearing a free stage uh, with a new teammate or teammate that owns a swimsuit costume grants a buff allowing you to obtain greater rewards use buff teammates to get event points faster okay so pretty much um new teammate or a teammate that owns a swimsuit so pretty much um you will need to have uh, that swimsuit custom right or that new character to get like bigger rewards and everything else okay so have that in mind let me see here special item let me just see it a little bit so this is the packs and how everything looks like okay fine we have event mission that is that part new teammate so this is it, we all and Xia Xia. We're gonna check it out in a moment, both of them. Lucky draw. So you need to, pretty much by grinding this event, we're gonna get those tickets and with that you can go for it. Oh, here it is, crush hit. 2023 vacation campaign. So we got a uh, jewelry, is for free here, pretty much, and the costume. 
but this is one out of six so maybe like when you finish this one the two out of six will unlock and we're gonna get more uh costumes to get from here event shop exchange shop and this is it so we're gonna get some fragments this is pretty the epic uh scrolls that can be used to awaken from the r to sr and sr to the ssr and many mo other materials right here okay boom 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 Ooh, yeah yeah, yeah. We, we can get two costumes for free 100 percent so that that's pretty epic and this is the event story uh -huh. so you finish this then you go here 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 you get the event points and then you can go here and with here you're gonna get many this event points etc and other materials and this is the stamina okay and then we can exchange it in the shop this is the buff buffs oh event characters and costumes i see now so huts has that buff jury has that buff volume has that buff xia xia viol and many others who have the costumes okay i see really good really good everything understandable okay now when we are done with that let me do a full review of these two characters and then the grinding can start okay i will also do the summons and then i can focus on grinding the event we're gonna see how all of this will go so let me go into codex let me go red team and here let me check let me start from v all i mean we're gonna see the preview skill and everything else so we all activates the torn to increase his attack by 80 percent and his swiftness by 80 that's insane <laughs> the percentages are all already insane i mean it's level five but bro in addition he becomes immune to status effect while torn is active we all skill are enhanced and his basic attacks jolt targets however his target is not rest his energy is not restored until uh, the torn is no longer active oh i see we all teleports to the enemy dealing 900 percent of his attack as damage and knocking them back before returning to his original position the skill is enhanced while the torn is active dealing the same amount of damage to the enemies in the rear uh, we all creates five bangs uh, deals 400 percent of his attack as damage and joel's target while torn is active each bang flies at a random target and explodes dealing 620 percent of his attack as damage and stunning the targets nice we all swiftness is increased by 12 for every red element at the start of the battle so pretty much when you're gonna use like full red team or use like Hwarium and xia in the same team uh his swiftness will he'll be like extremely fast guys 100 percent this guy will do insane damage uh, extremely fast jolts while Thor is active he'll go even more and more damage overall so yeah this guy will be insane for sure we all rise the blue ore to safe location when attack at close range increasing his attack by eight percent until the end of the battle now um cooldown five seconds max attack increase five stacks the cooldown is reduced to two seconds while the torn is active so he'll be extremely fast fast at like he'll be able to do a lot of attacks overall in the match insane damage swiftness overall crazy unit we just need to test out how much investment he's gonna need but have in mind usually ssr plus doesn't need like five million dupes like sometimes even without dupes it works just well but maybe now 16 chapter who knows uh but definitely a crazy character now i don't have to discuss is he a must summon or not because generally it's all about the luck here right even if you get to the ssr plus pity everything is random so just go for it definitely a crazy character 100 percent uh i didn't check out exclusive weapon that's my bad so we're gonna do that also but let me do first the preview we're gonna do also the same for xia xia and then we can end the video okay okay this is that attack peacock wings boom black horse oh. black hole sphere 
And now let's see his ultimate. Bro. His ultimate looks super good, bro. Let's go, Viol. Have in mind, now we have the swiftness increase, attack increase. He will go nuts now. He will go nuts. Like, completely nuts. Look all the buffs he have. Look all the buffs he have. I didn't pay attention to the damage. I need to restart it, and then... Let me just restart it really quickly. I want to see the actual damage. As him being maxed out completely. But of course, have that in mind. After he uses his ultimate, his attack goes by 80% up. And swiftness by 80 maxed out. That's insanity, guys. That's like, he will be doing with Hwarium. Him, Viol, and Hwarium combination is absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. One hundred and eighty-eight million, bro. Just like that. Let's see this damage. One hundred thirty-five multiple. It's insane. But wait a minute. I'm a little bit confused here. He doesn't do damage with his ultimate. I didn't pay attention to that. Like. Oh. I mean, he doesn't have to. Like, don't get me wrong. All, all that buff and swiftness that he gets. Oh, yeah, yeah. I see, I see. That's generally a buff for him, so he goes even crazier. I, I, I thought, like, usually they do damage even, even though they buff. But, yeah, he, he would be most likely too broken, 100%, if he'd done some craziness also with the special move. But he will do insanity with the actives, 100%, plus the passive. He will go nuts with the attack, 100%. Swiftness and attack is what makes him, like, super, super good. Okay, okay, okay. Everything now understandable. Definitely a character that you want to have, 100%. There is no doubt about that, okay? Where is my... Xia Xia, let's see her. Xia Xia increases the attack of all <laughs> of red element allies by 25% at the start of the battle. Xia Xia creates a barrier equal to 80% of her max HP for the two allies with the lowest HP that last for 10 seconds. While the barrier is active, those allies become immune to critical damage. When the barrier disappears, CXCO proportionally converts the remaining barrier into energy and recovers maximum recovery per bonus 100. Flashing a powerful light in front of herself, CXCO deals 800% of her damage uh, as, as of her attack as damage to the enemies in a fan-shaped area and blinds them. Xixia deploys a lighthouse to heal whichever of her allies has the lowest percentage of remaining HP by 1200% of her attack. The lighthouse also removes the uh, all that allies debuffs. The lighthouse follows the target ally for 5 seconds, healing their HP by additional 200% of her attack every second. Excess healing with a proportionally converted into energy. Bro. CX oh, I forgot Viol's exclusive weapon. The performance this CX here, right? <clears throat> the performance bonus of refundable barrier increases by 50. The performance bonus of high performance lighthouse increases by 50. Eyes wide open is enhanced to silence hit enemies for five seconds. The recovery effect of high performance lighthouse increases by 20. If the target is a red element ally. Uh, we're gonna check out the exclusive weapon from Viol in a second. <coughs> Xia Xia, in my eyes, looks insane support. Insane support. For the red allies, but for everyone else. Like, <clears throat> she will give you that longevity in the matches. Especially for the characters that have lowest HP. 
so she is in a way a savior right here 100 percent it will give you insane longevity in the matches with the barrier plus she converts that to energy which is insane bro look at this wow and e everything what remains from the barrier it converts to energy it is top tier support guys top tier support i'm telling you <clears throat> definitely a character that you want to have 100 percent there's no doubt about that 100 percent you want this character okay so both of these characters are amazing go for it summon if you wanna we all is definitely worth it xxia is definitely worth it uh and i cannot wait to actually test them out oh again here while the thorn is active we all attack is increased while the thorn is active we all becomes immune to the energy recovery block and energy decrease effect like the we all just needs to survive until his ultimate after that he will go berserk we all recovers 200 energy when the thorn becomes inactive we all becomes invincible for 10 seconds when the thorn activates superb top tier uh but I believe he will also need an investment, especially in the later stages, to work in a sense of exclusive weapon and everything else. But definitely, both of these characters are top tier, and we all will be completely insane with the damage and how fast he's gonna go. Okay, guys. We covered everything from today's update. Leave a like, subscribe, your opinions in the comment section below. I would really like to hear your opinions, like always. Uh, but this is it. Hopefully you did enjoy it and the next video will be um, summoning so we're gonna see how, how everything will go. Love you guys. Bye.